Salutations, Knifer. I'm Audrey. And I'm Paige. Today is Thursday, the 11th of April. Candy, something most middle schoolers like. Can some of our Knifer students guess the flavors of popular candies? Let's find out. And I'm Trent. And, and we're, we're the MCs of this candy contest. Today, three students will be trying to guess different flavors of candy. Now let's meet our contestants. I'm Morgan Martinez. I'm Billy Wink Bernoulli. I'm Marilyn Stubbe. The contestants will be blindfolded so they cannot see the candy. Here are the rules. No looking. You have to slap the table when you have the flavor. And no helping other players. The first flavor of candy you will be testing is Starburst. What? Strawberry. Yes, you are correct. Yes, you're correct. Yes. One point. High five. Now they will be tasting Tootsie Pops. It has to go ahead and taste. Is it blue raspberry? Nope. Bubble gum? Nope. Is it mine cherry? No, nope. they're all the same. All of you guys got it incorrect. So we get to test it again. See who gets it. Right. Yeah. Yes, I just oh. checked. Oh, really? Let's slap the table if you know. <laughs> it's the grape. Yes. Yes, you got it correct. The next candy you will be taking are airhead bites. <laughs> You may now taste the candy. Watermelon? No. What? Blue raspberry? Yes. That is correct. You won. Starburst, Airheads, Tootsie Pops, oh my! What kind of candy do you like the best? I like Tootsie Pops the best. Tomorrow is the day when Knifer students will participate in the Best Buddies Friendship Walk to empower connections between people of all abilities. You will be doing this during wellness classes, so get ready to walk with all of our Knifer classmates. Don't forget to wear your walking shoes, Knifer. You can also support Best Buddies by making donations before lunch outside of Ms. Evans' room, 202 South, Ms. Wolf's room, 101 South, and in the Student Center. Everyone who makes a $1 donation will receive a blow pop as a thank you. The Best Buddies Clubs ask that you be kind to our school by making sure that all blow pop wrappers make it to the trash. This is a great way to show night, night vision spirit. Do you see yourself as the next KNTV anchor? Can you imagine yourself chasing down an interview for an article you're writing? What about photojournalism? Might you be the next photographer for the Webster Kirkwood Times? If so, you might want to check out the KHS Summer Media Camp. It takes place May 28th to the 31st. You can find more information at www.kirkwoodcamps.com. This Saturday, April 13th, from 2 to 4 p.m. at the Kirkwood Public Library, there will be a teen tea party. This will be this will be to celebrate National Tea Day. There will be a variety of snacks and teas to try. Congratulations to Dr. Ellen Holly and her first semester's Art and Sustainability class for winning second place recognition at this year's Green Schools Quest. They are recently honored for their environmental efforts at the Missouri History Museum. Let's take a look at their award-winning project. This is wrong. This is wrong. This is wrong, Matilda.
First, art and sustainability class had a discussion about our main focus. We narrowed it down to upcycling and creating habitat. We combined these ideas to make a project making furniture out of honeysuckle and clearing it out of the area for new life. This is us finding honeysuckle on campus. For the project, we brought in help. Dale Dufer is a local furniture maker who came to our class and shared the process of making tables out of honeysuckle wood. After our brief lesson in table making, we gathered our wood from the woods behind the school. We then assembled and decorated our tables, giving them a personal touch. We also made various artworks surrounding the concept of a lack of pollinators. Finally, we opened a gallery to present our art to the other classes as well as show the meanings behind them. And that's our Green Schools project in a nutshell. Good job to all the students who helped make our Green School Quest a winner. This Sunday, there will be a stay and play event at the Kirkwood Public Library from 2 to 4 p.m. Come visit the library to play Alibi, a crime board game. Today's after school activities are Running Club in room 113 South, Intramural Soccer in the South Gym, Chess Club in room 110 South, Power Hour in room 106 South, Musical Club in room 5 South, Knife or Beats in room 211 South, and D&D &D Club in room 100 South. Fare thee well, Nifer. And remember, you, you belong, belong at Nifer. Nifer.